What is ends of infinity in Kabbalah and how can we perceive that term because our perception is limited and we always describe things in a limited way. That's right, perceiving infinity is a contradiction. How can I do that? So, uh, infinity uh, is not like how a person usually depicts. It's not infinite width or infinite weight and so on because it's out of our boundaries. Infinity is imperceptible. But infinity in the wisdom of Kabbalah is a very tangible thing that we attain. Why? Because it comes from the words ensof, no end, no boundary. No boundary to what? No boundary to the desire, to the fulfillment in the desire. Why? For instance, if I take this cup and I fulfill it to its end, then it means that this cup is in a state of no end, infinity, it's endless. Why? Because it, the, I fulfilled it to its very end. So if we feel our desire to its uh, greatest extent when it can't receive anything else, then it is in the aspect called ensof, no end, infinity.